Welcome back to the Castle Grounds. This is the Stupid Genius 55. I'm your host of Super Mario 63, the Let's Play of... Now, something I should point out, before we go any further, is we can... As I, is before, we, we couldn't go back to the left here. But now, we actually can. Now, and you might see this blue sun shines right here, and if you're not really experienced with the Mario, you know, franchise, no, this is not like a special blue shine sprite. This is just... just when you've collected a Shine Sprite already and you revisit it, it turns blue. This just represents the Shine Sprite that we collected in the cutscene earlier. But yeah, this, le this tutorial level is right... ...just like how it was when we last left it, basically. Uh, except for the fact that, of course, the screen is much darker. And I also can get back up. I also fell down here. Um, right. My apologies. This toad is back down here saying the exact same thing he did before. He is not concerned at all that the castle is shrouded in dark the mushroom kingdom is shrouded in darkness now, no siree. Alright, do you say anything different? I don't- I didn't pay attention to what, uh, the toads say in my practice run, so I don't know if- Nope, they don't say anything different. He doesn't care either, okay. This level is so much harder getting up here without flood, oh my god. Like, I tried. It's- it is technically impossible, actually. But, and, uh, getting up here because of that cloud. But, gah, yeah, you don't want to fall back down there, it's pretty bad. Uh, one shortcut you can take, actually, back to the castle is just collect the- That shine sprite represents our- Whoa, I'm on a pelican, kind of. But I was on a pelican. <laughs> I I know I'm, I'm weird, but that is actually a quick way you can get back to the castle. Should you want to do that, this castle here. And we have a toad we can talk to now. Hello, Mario. Since the shine sprites are starting to return to the castle, most of us toads are returning too. Before Bowser came, this place was full of toads running all over the place. Now it feels empty and secluded. I I I can't believe. In this fate. Like, I'm sorry, you know what? No. I, I know that I'm kind of being a bit weird with those voices, but you no, know, their facial expressions really do say that. I'm sorry. Whenever you get hurt by an attack, your HP is blade on top of the screen in a pie shape. Above it, it says power. Did you know when you collect the L coin, one of the letters on power glows? And when all three coins glow, you heal one HP! Okay. Um, yeah, he is correct about that. Correct Amundo. Now let's go and... Let's check up on Eddie. I didn't check what these toads say because... My practice runs, so... Hello, Mario. The old elevator here was expanded about a month ago. You see? Before Bowser came and stole all the shine sprites... Oh, he had an angry face. Sorry. I forgot about that. The elevator was getting way too crowded, so we... Made a different way out there via Slime Star! You just jump into it, press X to spin around, and blast up! Oh my god. Uh, no, wait, there's a toad in one of these elevators. Yeah. No, there isn't. Okay, I thought there was. Um, let's see what Eddie has to say about things. Hi, Mario! There must be lots of shine sprites hidden in the castle. Okay, now, this place is open here. Um, if you don't know... Where is this? It's actually the door we just opened with the, uh, the star coins. Yeah, uh, we got the five star coins, and now we've opened up the level editor. The level designer! Hurry, jump in and start your own very own levels! But, um... And you can even share your levels with other people. I'll be sharing it with you viewers, but I have... But don't stay too long. Mushroom Kingdom still needs saving. Actually, I do need to stay here and save the Mushroom Kingdom. I can't just keep being there. Enter create your very own level. You can also do that from the extras screen. La dee da da da. Yeah. Okay. Good. He actually, the developers actually agree with me that this is a really enthusiastic, Aztec looking face. Actually, he looks a bit sleepy now. I look at him a, a bit closer. La dee dee da da. -da. Ah! At sign. I know he's supposed to be swearing, but still. I got a paper cut. 
<laughs> God, what, what is up with you, Run Ow? Okay, what does this guy have to say? If you collect star coins, you can unlock new things in the level designer or open these hints insidious doors here. Yeah, these doors, you need uh, a very amount, varying amounts of them. 16. Uh, and they go up, like, incrementally, like, uh, by doubling. Like, look at this. Like, oh, like, sorry. Yeah, 32, you see how it doubles, then we need 60, 48. Oh, okay, this must be the 64 one. Um, all those give you things. Um, some of them can be a bit weird. But this, it here is just for, like, you know, the level designer. Now let's... Oh, there's new toad here. New toad, new toad, new toad. Okay. I don't remember a hallway being here before! <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God, okay. I, I know that I'm the one who's technically screaming here, but these... Their face... I'm just... You know what? I I'm just reiterating, reiterating what their facial expressions say. Sorry, does he say the same thing? Uh, yep, he is saying the same thing. Anyway. Um, I know I'm technically the one screaming in here, but... Uh, just repeat what I said. Um, let's go back down to... Oh, we have another toad here. We have another toad here. Let's see what he says. Hello, Mario. Did you know that there is a secret passage near the snow snowman's land painting? Yes, I did, actually. I discovered that long before I was supposed to. Just like with all the other stuff. Um... And, yeah, I've been doing a lot of missions out of order, it seems. There's no secret passage here. No, I already checked that. I forgot. Let's go back in here. We have two more missions to clear, and I've been just giving you a re-tour of Princess Peach's castle. This is the Collect the Eight Coins mission. For those who aren't familiar with Mario 64, it's exactly what it sounds like. Collect eight red coins throughout, hidden throughout the level. Well, not really hidden in this case. They're actually pretty easy in this one. It's the first level, so obviously. Our first coin, our uh, first uh, red coin is, like, right here. Now you have to collect eight of them, and you see this outline of a Shine Sprite right here? Yeah, that's where the Shine Sprite will- when we get all eight of them, the Shine Sprite will appear. Right there. Ah, yikes, I am not talking very well today. This is the second red coin. Um, anyway, how- around when I'm making this- uh, oh, number three. It's been- it's like, I, I just started getting on, you know, uh, being exempt from school, you know, for, you know, summer. And also, you're going to need to revisit some of the places you went to. Uh, well, I mean, of course you have to do, but I'm not talking about, like, for some of the secret stars. So this is the fourth break coin. But, anyway, I've been, like, you know, let off school. And right now, my, uh... Circadian Rhythm has basically been... Oh, I, what? Okay, I'm gonna get back up here. I'm gonna get back up here. Oh, I got... I got back up there. Um, for some reason, you know, I've been kind of getting that thing, that's the fifth red coin, where I just can't, like, like, my whole life is starting to go a little bit out of control, like, I'm not doing anything now that I, I don't have to... I'm gonna go to summer school in, like, a couple days. I'm gonna start physics, so... Let's see. This is the sixth star coin... red coin, I mean. Uh, I do not want to be calling them star coins. What? Well, uh, I should not use Flood up the top here. By the way, uh, you can... If you want an easy way to get to the second mission, and you don't want to do them out of order, and, and you don't want to do them out... If you do want to do them out of order, you can go up there. But yeah, basically, like, uh, my circadian rhythm's been actually completely messed up. Like, I will be going to bed at, like, four or five hours later than I usually do. And I can... I swear to God is able to get up there earlier. And I also been drinking a lot of way too much coffee, but let's not reiterate that. I could have sworn you were you could have got up there. Have I seriously been? How much time have I been spending telling you how to get up there easily? Well, I do know for a fact that all I have to do is just stand up here and use flood up there. Yeah, as I said, this is why flood is really broken in this game. I haven't played too much Mario Sunshine, so I wouldn't really know. Um, I actually only recently got my GameCube. I had a GameCube memory card that was uh, not working, and it's only recently until I got that replaced, and I haven't played my GameCube, ga GameCube games much, so. Anyway, the rest of our... We have two more, and they're both around here. Oh, wait, we don't have two more. Wait, one's over here, I believe. Oh, I got one up. Okay. Or maybe I just got, you know, the correct amount of coins. Anywho, um... 
I think I might be missing one, I believe. No, wait, no, I'm not missing one. Ah, you know what? I can't believe I've... It was over there. I was mistaken. I'm really sorry. Let's go. Actually, it is over here. Uh, I was mistaken. I, I apologize. Uh, uh, okay, let's not get hit by those falling boulders. Not, they're not really boulders. They're just black things. With this game, they come with so little warning. Like, seriously. This is where number seven is. And number eight, I believe, is just a little bit up here. Let's get it here. Wait, no, no, it's not. Pe Why am I missing one? I should have gotten one. Yeah, like that one down there was just was it. There shouldn't be any more around there. Should be around here. Is there one? Um, maybe I'll get to the sky area right here. Maybe this will help. It's around here. Hold on, did I get both of the? Yeah, I got both of the red coins up here. So. Yeah, I got them both. I, yeah, yeah. Alright, up oh, here. Ah, here it is. I missed one of them, and it's right. But, you know, it's in the same sort of area as the actual star, so I guess I kind of got lucky in a way. But wandering around lost there was not good, I, I will admit. I can't. I, I didn't know I, which one I was missing. Oh my gosh. I, I, I assumed I would have gotten that one. But now we just have one more mission here. It's actually really simple. And it's a... It's actually a mission... It's another mission I accidentally did out of order. I stumbled... Oh, another room was open. It, this is another mission I stumbled upon really early on. The Secret of the Mountain. Do I know what the Secret of the Mountain is? Well, it's secret, in fact. It's so much secret that whether or not, or not I know it's a secret it is also a secret. By the way, the discussion is also to be kept secret. Understand? I don't know why I'm stuttering so much when I'm reading today. These... These days, yikes, um, I don't usually start this much when I'm reading stuff, but this is something I actually discovered pretty quickly. As I said, this level's pretty, you know, like, not, the secrets here aren't that bad, I was gonna say. So, the secret of the mountain, you just keep going right, you know, to the... Kind of funny that the very first mission in the game takes place in the, like, base... Actually, not. nah, it's not, I was gonna say it would be a bit... Kind of funny that the very first mission of the game takes place, you know, up there. Like, you have to go really far in the level to get, and the other stars, you don't have to go this far. But uh, then again, you, you really are just going to the right and then going up, so it's not that complicated. It's The others are slightly more complicated than this. This little area here that's outlined for you is just where the star is. We are jumping in. The weird thing is, is that if I purposely miss... Two weird things about level. I purposely miss, I don't die, I just come back here. And the other is... We're about to see. Um, anyway, our last shine spark and our last dark one will be in this area, but... If you go over here, you might think that there's a secret, right? Well... No, it's just a red herring. And in fact, yes, it's... I've tried, you know, using Flood to go through there, but no such a... Uh, nothing, like, nothing... Maybe you could come here from some other way? But I don't really know why they did this. It's very peculiar. Very odd. Now let's just go up here. You can... If you, for some reason you don't have Flood at this point, you can get here. They give you it, like, a couple chances to get it, though, so... If you don't, you really should. Anyway, you can go up here if you... And get your final star coin. Uh, for this level, not for the entire game. I have no idea which one of you would be thinking that it would, I was going to mean the entire game. But, uh, these little blocks up here. Flood, uh, uh, this will be a lot harder without Flood. Maybe I'll do like a... I don't know, let's get up there. Now, uh, yeah. It just takes us right to the bottom, you know. It, we, like, we fall through. It can be a little bit disorienting, that final star, but, you know. What am I going to be doing? 